The state finals in rodeo concluded on Saturday in Douglas with spots on the line for the national finals that will be in Gillette next month. The top four in each event punched their tickets to nationals. In the bareback, Brian Brown of LaBarge, who attends Big Piney High School, won the short go at the finals and is the state champion. Brown is the defending national champion in the bareback, so he'll get a chance to repeat. Hunter Carlson of Douglas, Thomas Davis of Osage, and Tyler Erickson of Wheatland will be the other three national qualifiers in the bareback. Over in the saddle, Brock and Tyler Erickson of Wheatland will be at the national finals in two events by winning the state championship in what turned out to be a very difficult Saturday. Battle Bronc event. Ira Dickinson from Rock Springs, Warlands Trey Butterfield, and Dawson Norton from Newcastle also qualify for nationals in this event. The bull riding was a very difficult exercise for the preps with James Butterfield of Warland prevailing as the state champion. He'll be joined at the national finals by Jared Nosepa of Fort Washakie, Matthew Fenton from Ten Sleep, and Torrington's Riley Lane. To the steer wrestling, Tanner McInerney of Alzada, Montana, which is just north of Hewlett, won the state title and the average in the finals. Taylor Davidson of Douglas will be going to nationals along with Chance Anderson of McKinnon, which is in the southwest corner of the state. The last qualifier in the steer wrestling was Zane Thompson of Cheyenne. Thompson, by the way, won the all-around. In the team roping, Kellen and Carson Johnson from the famous Johnson Rodeo family just outside of Casper won the state title. Jaron Johnson teamed up with Wheaton Williams of Bighorn to take second and a spot at nationals. Two other teams will be going to Gillette as well. Zane Thompson of Cheyenne with Coulter Weiss of Riverton along with T.C. Hadley of Wheatland with Canton Afdahl of Torrington. Thompson was a busy guy. He qualified in the tie-down roping as the state champion. Owen Whaler from Grover, Colorado was second. Afdahl of Torrington third and Wyatt Tarver of Gillette was fourth. So those guys will be going to the big show. For the girls in the barrel racing, your state champion is Carson Bradley from Big Piney. Cheyenne Jacobson from Gillette qualified for nationals in the second spot. Gillette's Cheyenne Russell was third, and McKenna Balkenbush of Sheridan was fourth. In the breakaway roping, Quincy Segelke of Snyder, Colorado finished first at state, followed by Kate Dickinson of Rock Springs. J.C. Thompson from Lusk was third, and Balkenbush of Sheridan was fourth. To the goat tying, and Thompson wins state in this event. She also won the all-around, followed by Abby Devereaux of Newcastle. Balkenbush of Sheridan qualifies in her third event with Rayada Hour of Albin fourth. In the pole bending, Shea Huff of Gillette wins state, so that'll be a short trip for her to nationals. Devereaux from Newcastle second, Jacobson of Gillette third, and Bradley of Big Piney fourth. In the boys' cutting, the top four are Jonathan Lips from Casper, Wes Bray from Casper, Trey Butterfield of Worland, and Neil Jones from Farson. The top four qualifiers in girls' cutting, Riley Whitman from Big Piney, Casey's Anaya Windsor, Emily Ilgin of Sheridan, and Shea Bray of Casper. The top four in reigned cow horse, Gillette's Courtney Reynolds, followed by Hour of Albin, Clay Kinnison of Grover, Colorado, and Sadie Struman of Lusk. The national finals in rodeo in Gillette will be July 17th through the 23rd.